The main contenders in Guatemala's presidential race closed this weekend their campaign events ahead of June 25th elections. Presidential candidate Sandra Torres, widow of the former president Alvaro Colom, criticized the last three governments led by men who have defrauded the people and promised to reinstate the social programs that worked during Colom's government. For his part, ex-diplomat Edmund Mulet promised that all children in the Central American country will have their own digital devices for school. For her part, Zuri Rios Sosa, the daughter of the coup dictator Efraín Ríos Montt, assured that the candidates ex excluded for the next elections should have been part of the polls. Around 9.3 million Guatemalans are eligible to vote in the elections of June 25th, where besides president and the vice president, a new Congress for the period 2024-2028 will also be appointed.